happy Friday. Happy Friday. time. Please take a moment of silence to reflect on the anticipated activities of the day. Thank you so much. Please rise for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. All right, all right, all right. Good morning, everybody. It is a happy Friday. It is indeed Friday, April the 1st, 2022. Now keep in mind, I know today is April Fool's Day, but the student handbook is still going to be in force. So please think twice before you act. Okay, so I hope you have a wonderful, wonderful day. Now today is a B day for all classes. So you'll be attending your third, fifth and seventh period classes today. Uh, we are going to be on extended homeroom and we'll be doing the RTI process during the extended homeroom this morning so don't alter the rest of the day. We'll be on the regular B-Day schedule. So if you haven't already done so, teachers, you know, kind of post that schedule up on your wall so that everybody can see it. <clears throat> Pardon me. All right. It's a simple reminder of the safety protocols that are currently in place. If you have a mask and you wish to wear it, no problem. Remember, they're strongly recommended, but not mandated. We do ask that you continue to keep your distance as much as you can possibly keep it, and then wash or sanitize your hands as often as you can. Huge shout out, congratulations to both soccer teams for making the playoffs. When we return from spring break on Tuesday, April the 12th, the boys will be playing Cousins at Cousins for a chance to play in the championship game on Thursday. The girls are going to host the game against Memorial on that same Tuesday afternoon on the 12th uh, for a chance to play Cousins in the championship game on Thursday. So right now, we're working to determine the site for the championship game. So they're either going to be played at Sharp Stadium or they're going to be played at Veterans Memorial Middle School. We'll have more, in, more information on the Monday when we get back from spring break. Hey, softball players. Coach Lamb, the head softball coach at Alcove High School, is going to be having off-season workouts on Tuesdays and Thursdays from 4.30 to 6 at the Alcove softball field starting Tuesday when we get back from spring break. That's right, April 12th, they're going to start tryouts from 4.30 to 6 at the Alcove softball field, and tryouts are going to be held on the 10th and the 11th of May. Now, eighth grade girls, if you're interested in playing softball at Alcove next fall, you're encouraged to attend those workouts. The annual Title I stakeholders meetings postponed to again that Tuesday, April the 2nd. That's going to be a busy, or April the 12th, sorry. That's going to be a busy day for us here at Indian Creek. That meeting is going to be held virtually on um, at five o'clock on Zoom. And we're going to post that link on the website April the 11th, the Monday when we get back, and also be in the newsletter in the Panther Press that night. The yearbook order center is still open. 
now's the time to get your yearbook. As a matter of fact, the yearbook goes to press this weekend. So if you want to get your yearbook this year, go to yearbookordercenter.com, put in the school code of 15503, and you will be able to pay $35 for your book. If you want to put your name in the lower right-hand corner outside, it's an extra $5. All right. At this time, please join me in reciting the Panther promise to remind us all of what it is to be part of Panther Nation. I will be respectful, I will be responsible, and I'll be a positive role model. Hey, now we're in the month of April, so we have a new theme for capturing kids' hearts. And this month, the, the theme is perseverance. Now, perseverance is the willingness and the ability to keep going when things are tough. People who persevere show steadfastness and give extra effort needed to do something despite how hard it is or how long it takes to reach that goal. So think of it this way, as we prepare to head into the Georgia milestones 10 days from now, okay? 10 school days from now, we will head into the Georgia milestones. We need you to exhibit the perseverance that it's taken to get this far throughout the school year, learn what you've learned and put in that little bit of extra effort to be as successful as you can on those Georgia milestones. And with that, I wanna thank you all for your attention this morning. I wanna wish you the best spring break possible. I hope you have a safe and relaxing spring break. Teachers, I hope that you get some time to rejuvenate, spend time with your family and just take a deep breath. And I look forward to seeing everybody right back here on Monday, April the 11th on Creek TV. Have a great spring break, everybody, and have a great day. Take care now.